Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Guess I'll just get right into it. Um, my video today is a haul video. I've never done one of these on my channel before, so this is new. Let me know if you guys like these or not, because if you do, I will do more in the future. Um, anyways, but for this haul video today, it's all fish related stuff. I feel like I haven't really done many fish related videos on my channel, despite being really into fish. So. I'm gonna try and do more of those in the future, so let's start this out with a nice haul video. So in this haul, I got quite a few things for both my saltwater and freshwater fish tanks. I ordered some corals, um, I got some fish, I got some rocks, some new equipment, all that fun stuff. So a lot of this I did get at my local fish store and a lot of it I ordered online. All of the corals that I ordered in this video that you see came from Canada Corals. If you are in Canada and you are into saltwater keeping and you're looking for some awesome corals, like I would 100% recommend checking them out. This isn't like a sponsored video or anything. I just, like, I really love the company. Great prices. Awesome corals. I, like, I promise this isn't sponsored or anything. I just really think that they're a great company so yeah if you're looking for some corals and you're in Canada definitely check them out so I started this video out with like a little tour of my fish store kind of so you guys can get an idea of what my options were what kind of stuff they had and all of that fun stuff so there's a couple minutes of a fish store tour and then I get into my haul where I unbox my stuff and show you what I got I do also want to say there are a few things I left out because I want those to be a surprise in upcoming videos. I left out a couple things from my saltwater tank and I left out a lot from my freshwater tank because I plan on doing separate videos on all of these so I really wanted them to be a surprise in those videos so I didn't want to show them here. So yeah, if make sure if you want to see what I got, if you want to see my surprises, make sure that you're subscribed with the notifications turned on or else you might miss it and you won't get to see my awesome surprises, which I would recommend. Yeah, all of that being said, I guess we can just get right into the video now and enjoy the haul. <laughs> Alright, so this is the box here. It's the box, um, live fish. So let's go ahead and open it up and see what I can get. Okay, so I open it up and this is what there is. 
This here is just a heat pack to keep it warm. And then here is all of my things in here. Let's let's see what we got. All right, so in here I have two snails. Ooh, and I have a bunch of coralline algae on them, which is really good because this will help spread the algae in my tank. So I'm happy with these snails so far. All right, what is next? Ooh, okay. I get a freebie. I got a nice little free mushroom coral. Oh, where is it? Okay, there we go. Uh, now remember, these corals have just been on like a 20 hour travel, so they are probably gonna look quite poopy. But here is, I guess, my free mushroom coral. All right, and next up, we have Plum Bright's Hammer Frag. See, this is, this is a pretty nice size frag for a hammer coral. And I'm actually surprised that it's not like completely closed up. Like it's actually kind of open, which is surprising considering it's been in this bag for a while. But I am happy with how it looks so far. It's a pretty decent size. Hopefully once I get it under my lights and my good tank and stuff, it'll really color up. But it looks nice so far. All right, and who's next? Let's see. My clover flower pot on a Pora frag. Okay, okay. Again, another good size frag. I am pleased. I don't know what that pink thing is there. I guess we'll, we'll see. So here is my, what is it again? Clover flower pot gonna pour a frag. So here, here's that. Let's see what's next. Next up is my red hand leather frag. I've never had a leather coral before, so I, I don't really know what to expect, but I guess this is what it looks like right now. I guess we will, we shall see what it looks like once it opens up, because I, like I said, I have never had a leather coral before. What is next? Oh, and here is my green hand leather frag. Next up, oh, is this my last bag? I guess it is. Okay. Next up is my green branching hammer. Again, this is way bigger than I expected, so I have to say I am quite pleased. But these will look so much prettier once I get them in the right lighting and everything. But there are all of my corals and two snails that I ordered. So not only did I order some fish online, but I also went to my local fish store and picked up a few things, or not fish corals. One of the things I picked up at my local fish store were two of these bad guy cardinals. They're so pretty. I love these fish. So these two will be going in quarantine for a little bit before they hit the main tanks because I don't want to risk anything, diseases or whatever, getting in my main tank. So these two will be quarantined first. And then obviously this is all closed up right now, but this is um, some green star polyp. I'm going to be adding that into my tank and then I will show you guys once it opens up some along with the other corals I got. And then I also got this 69 brass, which will also be going in quarantine along with the Bangai Cardinal. So at my local fish store, I also picked up some of this stuff. Um, most of this is for my freshwater tank because I actually plan on redoing that. Now that my saltwater tank is done being remodeled, it's time to move on to my freshwater tank. So I bought this bag of white sand, some of these little rocks, um, this frag rack, but this is for my saltwater tank obviously, it's for my coral frags, and then I bought 8 pounds of dragonstone. I honestly love the way the dragonstone looks so much. I think it's so cool looking. So I'm definitely going to be posting a video once I get to redoing my freshwater tank because I plan on completely remodeling the whole tank and restocking it as well. So I'm super excited for that. So just know I will be posting a video when I get around to doing that. And big surprise, I decided to order some more. So now I have a second box to unbox. Here we have a pale tipped octospawn frag. Ooh, this is a big bag. What's this? Ooh, yes. Gargoyle gas walsophilia. I'm excited for this one. I can't wait to see what it looks like all colored up. And here we have another pale tipped octospawn frag. I didn't mean to order two of these. I literally just didn't pay attention. And after I ordered them, I realized that I actually ordered two. So I guess I have two of them now. Oh, here are my snails. They're just some cute snails. Red Montefiore, what is it? Capricornus frag. I probably did not pronounce that right. 
Um, but basically this here, this is my first SPS coral. Um, I've heard Montes are good for beginners. Like, they're a good beginner SPS coral, so I wanted to go with these. So we'll see how it goes. I, like I said, my first SPS, so who knows how it'll end up. Here is a yellow jacket frog spawn fray. And the last one is just another red Monty. I actually, I did mean to order two of this, by the way. I wasn't um, ignoring it again. Um, yeah, I did mean to order two. So a lot of the corals are kind of closed up right now because I was just cleaning in this tank, so I was messing around. So they kind of closed up a little bit. But now I thought I would just show you all of the corals I got. Also, please ignore all this algae that's super common in newer saltwater tanks. It sucks, but it's all part of the process. So yeah, you'll just have to deal with that for now. This here is one of the hammer corals that I got. This one right here is my torch coral. Um, it's so pretty. Like it's barely opened up when it's fully opened it's literally gorgeous like i'm in love with it it's probably my favorite these here are my two monty frags and my clownfish is a little camera hog aren't you uh yeah so these here are my two monty's uh, this here is the green gonopora i got of course like i said it's all kind of closed up right now but what can you do then moving over here, this one down here is my Walsophilia that I got. Up here is another hammer coral, the other one that I got. Here is one of the frog spawns. Here is the green hand leather. And over here is the green star polyp and the frog spawn. And it looks like my frag rack fell down again, so that's fun. Literally the worst frag rack I've ever bought. It just keeps falling down. I'm gonna have to replace the suction cups because this sucks. Pretending that the LG is in here, I think the tank looks quite, quite nice personally. So there you go. That's it. That's everything I got. Actually, I don't want to say that because, like I mentioned earlier, I did get some surprises. So make sure you're subscribed to my channel so that you don't miss what those surprises were because, I don't know, I mean, why would you want to miss an awesome surprise? So I guess instead I will say that's all I'm showing you today, but make sure if you enjoyed this video and you want to see more, make sure that you give this a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Like I said, please let me know if you enjoyed these haul videos because if you do, I'll do more and if you guys don't enjoy them, then I won't do more. I want to make sure I'm doing things that you guys like, so please let me know. Honestly, like, be honest. If you don't like them, let me know so I don't continue doing them. That's all I have for you today, guys. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you all in my next video.